So here's the bobcat that Fred shot last night. You saw him get all the quarters off. So we have the two legs, two shoulders, and two back straps. This is very similar to mountain lion, only in a lot smaller version. Mountain lion, bobcat, it's very similar in that it's almost like pork. It's like pork without the fat. So a lot of times if you wanted to um, do this as a ground meat or something, you could add a little bit of fat to it. Um, if you wanted to, to make chili out of it, anything like that. With this bobcat that Fred shot last night, I'm gonna go ahead and cut it into cubes. This is a very simple recipe. It's simply like bobcat nuggets. And uh, I do this with mountain lion, you can do this with venison, you can do it with any wild game meat or any domestic meat actually. And so all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and, and cut this back strap, get that, so I can cut it into nice chunks. And when I'm doing this recipe, I'll use, I'll use the hands, I'll use the shoulders, anything where you can go ahead and cube that meat works perfectly. The other thing that I've done with mountain lion or bobcat is I've also done it kind of in the oven with a blueberry and apples and a little bit of bacon. It is amazing. But this is a super simple way. If you just wanted to try bobcat, a little bit leery, this is a great way to do it. So I'm gonna go ahead and just chunk this up into small pieces. And I've got my egg and milk for my egg wash. And I've got my flour, which I'll put a little bit of seasoning in there. And then we'll head over and we'll get this fried up. Very simple. You do want to cook it thoroughly. Mountain lion, bobcat, you don't want to do that medium rare or medium. You definitely want it cooked completely through. And I have my flour and I'm just going to put a little bit of Jane's mixed up salt in there. So just season it a little bit. Mix that up. So now I have my cubes. And again, you can do any part of, of the bobcat. So we'll go ahead and get the egg wash, which is just the egg and the milk. And just beat that up so it's all mixed together well. And now you just take the chunks, put them in the egg wash, and then simply out of the egg wash, into the seasoned flour, and we'll just coat those up nicely, and then we'll head over to the stove. Okay, so we're gonna put about, about a half inch of frying oil in your pan. We're gonna go ahead and set that on a medium-high heat. Okay, I think our, our oil is ready, and We'll go ahead and start frying up some of these morsels. And like I said, you want to cook them thoroughly. And then you can serve them with any of your favorite dipping sauces. And while those are frying up, Put a little bit of barbecue sauce in the center. And you want to do them to a golden brown cooked all the way through. And let them drain a little bit. And set them around there. And while I'm frying up the rest of those, for those of you out there that wonder, can you eat bobcat? Absolutely. Enjoy.